welcome to my channel this is gonna be a hopefully quick introduction to the channel if you're interested after watching this or watching some of it at least i hope you'll stay because i think i'm gonna be doing some interesting things on this channel it's probably gonna be formatted in a way that's not very orthodox or very common on youtube i'm really about to just wing it and go with the flow but this is the outline for what you can expect to see on the channel. Firstly, I'd like to start with an explanation of what the channel name means. So the channel name is Kellology, right? And Kel, the first part, I mean, it stands for Kelly. It's half of my name. It's the first three letters of my name. Kel and Kellology stands for Kelly. The suffix ology means the study of or to study. And then the X in the middle is like to tie it together kel xology but the x is silent you can think of the x as like a multiplication sign like you're combining the two together so kel xology kelology the x is silent and it's basically just the study of kelly so this channel is just me doing me things and yeah it feels kind of self-absorbed but what youtube channel isn't like let, let's be real y'all let's let's be real here um what vlogging slash you know lifestyle channel isn't kind of self-centered and self-absorbed yeah, i should introduce myself give you the basics like my name my name is which is kelly my pronouns are she they and my favorite color is purple and i love all shades of purple if you are looking at my background which i'm pretty sure some of you are because it's very busy the walls not not her not her walls they are a shade of purple i think this is lilac if i'm not mistaken it looks more like lilac than lavender but yes i love purple i do a lot of purple things another cool fun fact about me is that i love gur i like gur from invader zoom i love gur i've commissioned someone for press on nails with gur on them i've already talked to my parents about having a gur cake <laughs> for my birthday so you guys can probably look forward to that i have gur earrings i have a gur plushie i have a gur hoodie and now i have a gur t-shirt i have so much gur stuff but it's not enough because i saw a gur book bag at hot topic when i went and i want one i want it so bad i also want the gur funko pop and i don't collect funko pops but i want that one yeah a couple of things that you could expect to see on this channel would be k-pop dance covers brief ones because I'm not there yet. I have a long way to go with like filming and editing. Also, some dances are really hard to do without backup dancers, so having to modify them is quite a challenge too. Um, but with modifying, you meet a lot of criticism from fans. That is another topic for another video though. We can talk about that later. That is another thing that you may be seeing, which is commentary videos. I'm not gonna do them really long and they're probably not gonna have a lot of media in them as i am still a beginner in this whole youtube process so as time goes on the quality of the videos will go up as you know i think that's really self-explanatory on youtube you see that all the time with many creators i'm also going to be filming my sewing journey and taking you guys down the road with me on learning how to sew and really like getting better at my craft within sewing and making new things finding patterns learning how to make patterns and all that great stuff so i hope you guys will join me and um, tune in for that and that's probably gonna be one of the first few videos you see on this channel something about me sewing to be honest the majority of the content just might be my sewing journey so hey you never know you can also expect clothing hauls but they'll probably be like really short videos of me just showing you stuff trying it on being like mm, i like this or mm, not so much i think i'm gonna send this back which I rarely do because I don't like having to put in that much effort to send things back. L-O-L. A couple of maybes that you can expect to see are song covers because I do sing. I've been a trained vocalist for three years now. I go to a performing arts high school and I major in vocals. So you might see some song covers or snippets of my own original songs which might just be harmonies because I'm having a hard time producing. Another content maybe 
would be dress up and <laughs> dress up is really just me going through my closet taking things out and trying to style my wardrobe in different ways i used to do it all throughout the pandemic like i spent so much time throughout the pandemic just taking my clothes and finding new ways to style them which helps me a lot now because i don't feel like i have to wear the same outfit over and over and over again so i'm really happy that that worked for me and maybe through just hearing about this or watching me do it you'll be inspired to do it too because it helps a lot you don't feel the need to buy new clothes all the time it helps you develop a sense of fashion and a sense of style within your own wardrobe it also helps you keep track of what you do and do not like within your wardrobe so if you really don't like a piece and it doesn't fit whatever you're going for currently you can give it to a donation center or use it for sewing there's so many different things that you can use those garments for you can use it for cleaning hey you can use it for tying up your hair at night you can use it for drying your hair you can use it for when you spill something on the floor you can use it for whatever you want to use it for you can even throw it away which i don't really recommend because there's a lot of uses for cloth until it like goes bad like you cannot use it anymore it has or it has minimal use or you can like flip it like you can make it into something else but I digress. It's literally one of my most favorite things to do. I literally play dress up to make this outfit that I'm wearing right now. I'm gonna try to keep it as real as I possibly can and stay as honest as I possibly can and not have to filter out so much within the channel. Like I want it to be authentic and authentic as I can. I don't want it to be all stuffy. Cause sometimes I feel like that when I'm watching vlogs or I'm watching people do stuff like it's so, so, so stuffy. And I hope this isn't stuffy. Like I'm just sitting here like, all poise and stuff but in reality i have these little thingies because these are these are tights and <laughs> the, the little the little toe hole and i'm playing with it while i'm sitting here because i can't really sit still and i don't have any of my fidgets nearby so that marks the end of this introduction video these are gonna be updated whenever i have new stuff to add or whenever I feel like it, I'll probably just film a new one. I hope you guys enjoyed it somewhat and are going to tune in again. I can't wait to see you guys again. If you do, and if you don't, that's okay. I'll still be here whenever you decide, hmm, what's that girl with the rainbow girl hair doing? You know, I I'll be here. Hey, I'm, I ain't got nothing, hey, I ain't got nothing else to do. Yeah, if you'd like to see more of me outside of YouTube, I have Instagram, Snap and Twitter. My Twitter is APJXICE. On Instagram and on Snapchat, you can find me at Kellology. Same as the channel name, spelled the same. See you guys next time. Bye. This is off the dome, no script. Yeah. Because. Stop acting wrong and put your sheets on your bed. I'm filming right now. That was so stiff. So <laughs> you can tell I'm a bar. I'm just. What's your name? BLB. So they call you Bob. Because I want my words to be out. Oh. <laughs> Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's before I started filming. Before I started filming, <laughs> a couple of things that you could see, you could. <laughs> I can always just like. I didn't fart, guys. <laughs>